Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. My name is the Prince of FNAF and if you're new here, please consider subscribing and also be sure to hit that notification bell. That way, you'll indeed be notified for any awesome videos like this in the future. As mysterious and cryptic as the blob is, the blob is only seemingly aggressive to burn trap for some unknown reason. The blob consists of an amorphous mass of wires and cables with entangled animatronic bodies and limbs. The only animatronic body part that seems to have some kind of sentience is the damaged Funtime Freddy head. While the Blob does have sentience, it's mainly characterized as a savage, mindless monster. In fact, the first thing it does when it sees Burn Trap is brutally attack Burn Trap for no apparent reason, dragging him farther into the ruins of the crumbling FNAF 6 pizzeria. It is commonly believed within the Five Nights at Freddy's community that the Blob is in fact Molten Freddy. Molten Freddy appears during Five Nights at Freddy's 6 Pizzeria Simulator, and he, much like the Blob, is a mass of cables and wires with a very similar Freddy Fazbear mask. Now, it is made unclear whether the Blob and Molten Freddy are actually related, and if they are in fact the same character, but they do share very eerie similarities, with them both being these amalgamations of wires and cables with a very similar Freddy Fazbear head attached to their bodies. Now, with that being said, there is no hardcore evidence stating whether or not the Blob is just a further distorted and amalgamized version of Molten Freddy, or if he's his own character. The Blob does not appear to have a very good visual acuity, as you can walk around it and it won't kill you. The only time the Blob ever seems to kill you is when you're right in its line of sight, where it will violently and viciously drag you into these pothole vent-like systems and kill you. The Blob will appear during the Burn Trap boss fight several times through two holes, one in the ceiling and one in the floor. They're treated almost like vents or grates, and the Blob will appear in the bottom of these grates and will use its tentacles to feel around the room. If you happen to touch one of these tentacles or look directly into these crevices, the blob will grab you and pull you down and kill you very violently and aggressively. Very interestingly, it seems that the blob uses echolocation to find out where its prey is because of its lack of sight, and using its tentacles, which seem to be made up of long animatronic cables and wires, it is able to find its prey, which is very interesting and is seen in several different animals like whales and bats. It is not made clear what happened to Burn Trap and the Blob after the events of Five Nights at Freddy's Security Breach, but it is assumed that they died or at least got destroyed during the collapse and fire of the ruins of the FNAF 6 pizzeria location. But let me know what you guys thought about my look at the Blob, one of the more cryptic and mysterious characters to come out of recent Five Nights at Freddy's games. But with that being said, hope you guys enjoyed, do take care, and have a great night.